I am Apostle Perry Maples, the pastor and overseer of the Apostolic Deliverance Temple Church of the Lord Jesus Christ, 1369 Novice Road, Memphis, Tennessee. Friend, I have a word from the Lord that's going to bless you. And that word is forgiveness. Forgiveness, forgiveness. The Bible says in St. Mark chapter 11, verse 25 and 26, And when ye stand praying, forgive if ye have aught against any, that your Father which is in heaven may forgive your trespasses. But if ye do not forgive, neither will your Father in heaven forgive your trespasses. Friend, there are a lot of people today are living with the burden of unforgiveness. Yes, unforgiveness and they're really living their life connected to another for an offense or something that has happened in your life whether it be abuse mental or physical and you are carrying that burden every day and you are living a miserable life you go to bed with that you wake up the next day with that same burden. But there is a word from the Lord, and I want to speak it into your spirit today. And when you get this word, tomorrow will be a better day for you. I want you to know that forgiveness really is to release, set at liberty, loose, and let go. Just let it go. It's to cease to feel resentment against an offender. That means cut it loose and let it go. Forgiveness is an essential part of a strong, healthy relationship. Many families are torn apart today because of unforgiveness. Doctors even say that 75 to 80 percent of health marital and family problems come from unforgiveness. Did you not know that many people have the disease of unforgiveness and they are going to the physician, he cannot diagnose the problem. The problem is unforgiveness. You are the one that can release yourself by forgiving the one that have offended you. Forgiveness in of its genuine forms, in all of its genuine forms, is a means of healing. So if you want to be healed today, it does not come from the physician. It's going to come from you. The choice is yours to release and let it go. Because forgiveness is not something that you do for other people. You do it for yourself to free your Spirit, because the person who gains the most from forgiveness is the person that does the forgiving. So I'm speaking this into your spirit. Someone has abused you, misused you emotionally or physically. You release it and let it go. Release it and let it go. Do not carry that burden any longer. Forgive the person. Forgive the person. Say, what about them? It's not about them. You are going to gain the most out of you forgiving those that have offended you. God bless you. May he keep you. And may your tomorrow be better than today. See you next time.